everyone in today's video we will fix the whatsapp notification not working on your samsung galaxy s25 and s25 ultra so to fix this problem you can follow these steps step one is to check whatsapp notification setting you can simple open your settings then after you can go to notification then click on app notifications and here make sure that the whatsapp have a permission to send notifications so right now you will see the notifications is turns off so you can simple toggle this button on okay and then also verify it by simple op go to your app info then long press on the app icon then click on i buttons and then go to permission and here you will find the notification permission if here you will find notification permission in not allowed you can simple tap on it to give them allow okay the next step is to verify system notification settings so go back to your settings here you can simple go to app notifications sorry click on lock screen notifications and here make sure that the lock screen notifications are turns on and also the show contents is enabled then after tap on the setting icon and here make sure that the whatsapp have a permission to send notifications on the lock screen the step 3 is to disable dnd mode so swipe down from top to open the quick panel okay and here make sure that the dnd mode is turns off okay if it turns on you can simply turn this feature off the step 4 is to turn off battery optimization for whatsapp so samsung battery optimization can restrict app from running in the background which might block whatsapp notifications so in that case you can go to your settings then go to apps then click on battery optimization sorry not in apps go to battery then go to background app usage limit and here make sure that the whatsapp are not available in sleeping apps okay and also disable this feature to put unused app to sleep and at last resort you can simple clear the app cache memory so long press on the application then click on i button here go to storage then here you will find a clear cache option tap on it to clear the app cache so these are the steps that can help you to fix this problem goodbye